Doggerland was a section of land that connected Britain to continental Europe thousands of years ago, stretching from what we now call the east coast of Britain to what we now call the Netherlands, the western region of Germany, and the Danish peninsula of Jutland. In other words, 10,000 years ago, Britain wasn't an island, now submerged beneath the depths of the North Sea. Doggerland was home to humans during the Mesolithic period, with hunter-gatherers enjoying the produce of this land, where the fish hunted and collected berries and nuts. In fact, human footprints have been found on the seabed of the North Sea, and at one point, Doggerland was considered to have the richest hunting and fishing grounds in Europe. Archaeological interest was sparked in 1931, when a fishing trawler dragged up a barbed antler point that dated back thousands of years. Numerous boats have since dragged up remains of mammoths and even lions, as well as tools and weapons used by the inhabitants of Dogger Land. Following the last glacial maximum that ended around 20,000 years ago, ice gradually melted and the climate warmed. As the ice melted, rivers, lagoons and heavily wooded areas began to take shape on Dogger Land, attracting both animals and humans alike. Rising sea levels gradually made Dogger Land less and less inhabitable, until it was finally flooded around 6500 to 6200 BC, and it sunk into the North Sea. It was finally wiped off the map by a tsunami, known as the Three Storega Slide, which were submarine landslides in the Norwegian Sea, with the resulting tsunami rippling out across the seas and it was thought to reach North America in under three hours. Considering the ferocity of this tsunami, it is no wonder that it wiped Dogger Land off the map. Today, very little of Dogger Land remains. There is, however, in a shallower region of the North Sea, a large sand bank called Dogger Bank, known to fishermen for having an abundance of fish. Dogger Bank and Dogger Land get their name from doggers, and no, not them kind of doggers if you're from Britain. In this context, doggers means medieval Dutch fishing boats, especially used for catching cod. Although I'm not 100% sure on the exact pronunciation. Despite all the debate over lost islands such as Plato's Island of Atlantis, whether real or invented, what we can say for sure is that Dogger Land is a real historical and archaeological landmass that did exist and was in fact swallowed up by the sea sometime around 8,000 years ago. Thanks for watching, please let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you would like to support this work, all the links are in the description below. You can support me through Patreon, buymeacoffee.com or donate through PayPal. You can also spread the word to your friends and family about this channel. Please also subscribe and hit the bell to turn on notifications. Like I say, thanks for watching, I'll speak to you next time.